based on fatal leaps uh, in this war, but he should be aware that the International Criminal Court is already looking at what is happening in Ukraine, and there will be serious consequences for him personally. The British Ministry of Defence has said there's heavy fighting taking place in Kharkiv, the second largest city in Ukraine. Street fighting broke out there following attacks on airfields and fuel facilities by Russian forces. The United Nations have confirmed at least 64 people have died and at least 240 have been injured, although the actual figures are expected to be higher as reporting on casualties continues. Two more train operators, including East Midlands Railways, are bringing back services cut in December. High COVID cases saw staff shortages cause a strain on networks, with the changes brought in to limit disruption and cancellations. When you go back to work next week, you're being urged to do the hours that your contract is for. It says new research says more than one in ten workers in the East Midlands are doing an average of eight hours unpaid overtime a week. Rob Dunderson from the local branch of the TUC union has said a lot of the responsibility has to do with managers. Managers manager need to ensure that people are paid properly and, and not take advantage of workers who are trying to get on, trying to do their bit. And workers who, who are 